As COVID-19 cases across the state continue to go up, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz is once again issuing new guidelines. ABC 6 News reporter Blaze Keller joins me in studio with the latest on some new restrictions, Blaze. That's right, Betsy. We've seen a record number of positive cases recently, and new Governor Walz was going to take action. It was just a matter of what action he was going to take. And today, he turned back the dial on restaurants, bars, as well as group gatherings. I'm as frustrated as you are. We should have broke the back of this thing months ago in this country. We have not. On Tuesday, Governor Walls announced new guidelines for Minnesota as the cumulative total for positive cases in the state nears 200,000. Bars and restaurants will feel the impact with the curfew of 10 p.m. being in post starting this Friday. After 10, no dine-in services will be allowed and customers will not be able to go up to bars to order a drink. Um, bars and restaurants. Indoor and outdoor capacity of 50%, no more than 150 people. Counters are closed for seating and service unless counter service only. Patrons need to be seated at tables. No bar games um, that require standing is permitted. Wall says current data supports these moves. We're getting the data so much better at the data on this that we actually know statistically after 9 o'clock when we contact Trace, that we're seeing a doubling, at least a doubling of infections that are happening after 9 o'clock as opposed to earlier in the evening. These are the outbreaks that we've seen from June through November. 71% of our spreading cases are happening in private social gatherings, weddings, funerals, restaurants, and bars. Governor Walls also announced a 10-person limit to any indoor or outdoor gatherings. That also starts Friday. Meanwhile, weddings and funerals will ultimately be limited to only 25 people. That will be a phased approach starting November 27th. With these new restrictions and the winter months approaching, limiting the outdoor options for business owners, the governor also announced additional small business relief. We are increasing the size of our small business relief grant to an additional $10 million. Steve Grove, commissioner for the state's Department of Employment and Economic Development, says that while Minnesota has lost over 380,000 jobs since the pandemic first began, in recent months, half of those jobs have returned and that job growth is slowly on the rise. Live in studio, Blaze Keller.